Hello, all you lovely people. Next to me, it's uh, not Tomas today, uh, but a really good friend, Marco, all the way from Italy, from Passion Brewery. And Marco is a super nice guy. You met him here in the brewery. He was one of our guests at our earlier math fest. And uh, whenever he's around, he's just showing up and he's bringing us all these beautiful beers. Passion Brewery, you've heard the name, you know the name. Uh, so we were like, yeah. Hi to everyone. It's why not? It's a pleasure to be here. Thank you to invite me. Why not? Uh, why not to have Marco here and let's uh, let's talk about his beers. And uh, he brought so many beers like double dry hop, New England stuff, and so on and so on. But Marco does some amazing pilsners and lagers. I try to do. So let's to thank let's, you for the let's talk about this one. Trinkami, trinkami. Trinkami, trinkami is like is like a, a joke with words. It's from the German is tr trinken trinken it's like drink drink and it's um, to remind the, the easy drinkable that I try to, to put in this beer it's 1.1% ABV just because our brewery our tap room is um, you must to go by car on the bike and we had some people that said oh I can't drink just because I have to take the drive I take the car. So to have another problem, we want to so we wanted to try to um, create a beer with no alcohol, just because the law says that un under 1.3 is no alcohol, and this is so well, it's 1.1. 1 .1, but our it's result, yeah, technically yes. it's not. Technically it's not alcohol, beer, just because yeah. they they said the law says that the the the, the, the alcohol under 1.3 can appear in your body. So. For the pregnant, for the truck drivers, for the oh, for, uh, for fitness people. All right. So so even even Tomas can uh, taste it now. <laughs> he's not uh, he's not drinking because of the vaccination. Of course, the body is a beer about a beer with one point one. This is super nice, super crisp, like a. This, I'm, this brings me back to his Germany. Dry hopped with um, with uh, Tetanang and the Polaris. Oh wow. It really brings me back to, to Berlin, uh, you know, when you're just day drinking under the sun, you're mm -hmm. drinking all these, uh, you know, cheap lagers that have low ABV and so on and so on. Uh, and, it's, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's but it's not missing, uh, it's, it's not really missing anything that, uh, that you seems would... Uh, yeah, seems exactly, to be. Yeah, exactly, that, that like a non-ABV beer, that, you know, they all have the same taste. But this is awesome, man. Reminds of beer, it's, it's, you, can, you can also blind it, you can... You can taste that is beer. All right. Uh, so if it was a proper tasting video, I should have brought you know different uh, glassware for all the different beers. But we don't want to bore you with a uh, long chit chat. We always do that behind the scenes. So <laughs> I will just uh, I will just uh, chug this and uh, let's open up a second one. Oh, this is so good. All right. Uh, what do you suggest, Marco? I suggest um, classic Hellers. A spring and Sprangen. Spring and Sprangen. Spring and Sprangen. I, another <laughs> okay, another, another play another, with words. <laughs> another fake name just because I can't speak German. And when you go in Oktoberfest and you see all the people singing, for me the sound of that songs are Spring and Sprangen, Spring and Sprangen, Spring and Sprangen. So that is <laughs> Spring and Sprangen. And is. Uh, this one is your signature Hellas. It's. I mean, I've had this. I think that is one of the beer that I'm. I'm. I'm proud of. Also because it's. Um, it's a proper, classic, Hellas flavor, but being a. A perfect replication, of uh, of a Hellas. You must be. You must follow so technical or technical things, and it's quite. It's, you are. You are not to. Um, some hops to hide some defect maybe but just yeah uh, exactly. just work on the techniques and and also because you need two months to do it exactly yeah. so it's uh, lots of patience no crazy additions lots, lots, of, lots of hop not hops but hope <laughs> <laughs> all right this is not the first time you're doing this right <laughs> uh, but uh, i mean i know that uh, you are just you know really strict to yourself with the quality and i've and I know that uh, you don't let anything out of Passion Brewery uh, yeah, that you're not 100% satisfied with. That is, that is something that we always uh, some usually had uh, a fight with, with my business partners just because if uh, the, the first um, 
enemy of the brewery is Marco, just because uh, I, I'm quite I'm quite serious to to my beers. Also because I I would never give you something that I won't drink first. Yeah, yeah. So uh, for me, it has to be. I I imagine always myself on the other side of the thinking with the head of the yeah, customer. Yeah, if, if I will be the I, I'm the first customer of myself. So I I really would like to drink it if I would be in the other side of the of the bar. Yes, if it's yes, okay, we can. I I will sell. Hey, All right. About this, I'm quite happy. But I know I know that uh, you're not always satisfied. And you're just never afraid to cancel one of the releases. Yeah, of course, of course. Be of because course. we've been already talking about this. And whenever Marco is around, uh, this is always the, something he brings. Because we're fanboys of a nice Hellas. Alright, I will just uh, kill this. And uh, because we don't want to bore you. And because I'm just super excited for this one. Let's talk about Peppa Pils. It's a double dry hop Italian Pils. Italian Pils is such a new, uh, maybe some of you already know um, about the Tipo Pils of Birificio Italiano. Okay. It's uh, the, the, something that changed the, the uh, way to see the Pils in a, in a lot of way, just because it's a, it's a Pilsner. It's quite, it's quite clear one, still and really uh, double dry hopped. In, um, in what this, kind of hops? This is is a topat, okay. so it's a, um, similar to the Galaxy. If uh, for the for the ones that doesn't know, and uh, uh, Tetnang, Tetnang, and a bit of Polaris. Oh wow! And it's really fruity. Yeah. Wow! You could you wouldn't imagine. And now uh, I understand what you meant by double dry hop Italian I think because been... because. It looks like to be a pills, and also, and, and, also and in the mouth is quite exactly. But the after, the aftertaste is not a pills at all. The aftertaste is like a session IPA. It's like a fruity or a really dry, dry hop session IPA. Mm -hmm. In fact, the one I would like to mix it is. And what is the ABV is five point five, but it yeah. feels like again like four point five or something like that. Thank you. Oh wow, wow! I mean, it's really bold. Uh, I mean, most of the craft breweries they don't have. A, any Hellas or Lager, and it's really bold from you to yeah. have so many of this style. I've got, I've, I've, at the beginning not, just because my knowledge for, for me wasn't enough to, to create good good quality um, But lager. your knowledge, I mean, you, you've, been to, you've been to so many breweries yeah, before. But you, you, you know better than me that we, at the point that you would think that you know something, you're wrong. We will never We always know talk about everything. this, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. That is why also we love our, our work. There's always, always something to learn. And it will be forever, I hope. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's, a, that's really a nice bottom line. Uh, thanks a lot for joining us. Uh, so I could have some really nice beers with my friend Marco. Marco, thanks for Thank being you. the champ, for visiting us. We are pleased. And Asia. whenever you see uh, passion beers, just make sure you go for them. It's, uh, you won't be disappointed. Cheers for that.